blue sky smiling at me Nothing but blue skies do I see So great on a great on a station hill And I know that I talk about Inkscape quite a lot on my DA And um, I'm sure many of you are wondering what the hell it is Well, first of all, this cool program is free, yo It's Inkscape.org Okay, so go to Inkscape.org and then download, and voila, the download. Tis free, yo. Tis fucking free. Legally fucking free, and it's amazing. It is a vector program. What is vector, you say? Basically, what a raster image is, is when, say, this is Photoshop, by the way, it is not free. So I'm gonna draw a lovely little line. It's a line, woo. But when you zoom in, the quality tis gets terrible. Now, what happens when I resize it to about, let's go, it's the quality is even worse. And we can go even bigger, washa, quality even worse. Now that's raster. Vector is where, say, and now I'm gonna draw a line. Okay, so there's a line. Now, you can go in, and in, and in, and in, and oh my god, it's still amazing! <laughs> so that is what the vector is. Now, I don't know how to do everything in Inkscape, like, uh, say, my hair right here. I don't know how to color that. You, you can only, like, color closed objects and such, but that's not why I'm here. I'm here to show you other stuff that you can do. I'm here to show you the things that I know how to do. First of all, Okay, you got your file, you got your edit, view, layer, blah, 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 blah. You make new layers by going add layer. Um, if you make a line and you want to move it to another layer, you move selection layer above or below. Or shift page up, shift page down. Um, object, fill in stroke is where you not stroke it like stroke it, guys, but like... <laughs> okay, come on. <laughs> and also, you can zoom in by pressing the plus key. Or zoom out by pressing the minus key. Okay, all right. Using the wheel, if you have a wheel on your mouse, go and you can go sideways. But so this is um, I'm doing a basically a family portrait. There's Michael, there's me, and there's Senpai. This is going to be a uh, a picture that goes into my room in my house in Smilesville. So. The way I'm gonna start this, yo, and I use clip art to make, to, to show what I'm going to make for, for the clothes, yo. I need to start out with a charcoal. OMG, it's solid black. Holy shit, snacks. Eh, eh. There we go. And oh my god, I really don't like that it's brown. Okay, it's black now. And this little arrow right here is where you can scale stuff. And not only that, yo, click it again. Rotation, yo. Oh, 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 oh! And these little areas on the side? Distort it! Yeah. So that's that, and click it again in order to get to the regular scalable part. And I'm uh, gonna stretch it out, stretch it out, stretch it out. It, it, you know, it doesn't have to be perfect. I mean, it all depends on... Ah, shit! This isn't supposed to be on this layer. Here we go. Move selection to layer above. There we go. And that's how you do that. Say, say, we all make mistakes. And then you can duplicate it and bring it another over here. Make sure the heads are real shame size. You know, I duplicate and go over here. Uh, relatively the same time. Okay, so now you have a circle. Now over here is a little line with snaps to path. Now say you make a line. Now if you, um, it's hard to switch from Photoshop to Inkscape sometimes. If you look, I mean from far away it looked like you were on the line, right? Well, you know what? You weren't. But make it easier on yourself. Snap it. Wrap it. And you go and go and go and go. Hey yo, there it is, right there. If you get too close, even it's gonna do it anyway. Uh, you gotta get a certain plan of play. Blah 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 blah. <laughs> and then if you use this one, then it'll basically like, if you have a corner, it'll go to the corner. Oh, and you click on this to make nodes visible. 
and then move it and then it snaps to the corner better. Also, double click on the line, you make another node, yo. Speaking of nodes, your circle right now, you are unable to select said nodes. So, what do you do? You go to path, you go to simplify. Now you got them nodes, now you can move them around, now you can add and subtract, yo. In order to subtract a node, you click on that node and you go over here and subtract a node. And, so say you have a node. Say you don't want this segment here. You don't want it here. There's a bunch of different things up here. Click on delete segment between two non-endpoint nodes. Sounds like a bunch of gibberish. Just click it. Bye! Now what if, what if, say, you, you, you want it there, but you don't want it here, okay? That's where you collect, I meant, break a bar. <laughs> so now, okay, now, oh my god, it's separate. But return to watch that other thing that you thought was a murder barber. Da -da. Hooray! I did it! Now you got two little nodes right here. You don't want two of them, so click on join select the nodes. It's one node, baby! Now, you can make uh, some lines sharp, yo, but what if you don't want it sharp? I mean, even if you look away, it's it's kind of sharp. You can't, like, make it totally round, and that bothers you. Click on the node. This one. But if you move it around, it moves around, you can make meh, meh, loop-de-loop and pull, and your shoes are looking cool. Now, what if you want it sharp? <clears throat> now it's sharp again. Okay? Now! Say you're like working on My Little Pony stuff and you got this like little thing that you don't like or or say it does this where you want it sharp at certain angles, you can make sharp or it'll go flat. You don't want that. So press convert selected object strokes to path. Yeah. And then what I like to do is I like to press the snap thing just so it snaps to that node. And there you go. You got some sharpness. You're gonna have to play around with it a little bit, you know, do some stuff. You can take notes and you can sharpen the notes and you go wait. And <clears throat> you know, sometimes if you sharpen them they don't move. But hang 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 hang. So that's that. Now, now that that's over. Alright, so that's basically the basics of basically what I know basically. Now, say now, what I'm gonna do. Oh by the way, if you click under the background, it's gonna go over here. This little eyeball, yeah, yeah, get it in. And it is layer, yeah, yeah, oh no, the circles go away. Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this. Snap it! Snap crackle pop, yo. Can I look kinda fat? <laughs> we don't wanna look kinda fat. Back. Not right now, okay? I know I'm kind of chubby, but, but my, my, uh, what did I just do? Control Z. <laughs> when you press the, the, the plus and the minus sign thingy on the keyboard, be careful not to press the brackets, because I guess the brackets do other stuff, so I don't know. Even though I myself am kind of chubby, I don't want my cartoon character to be kind of chubby. In a perfect world, we're all hot, okay? And stuff. There's my dress. Mine's a little more simple than the other two's, but that's okay. That's, you know, I don't want too much. hi -ya. And then hi -ya. Now, do I want it sharp or do I want it round? I think I'm going to keep it sharp, yo. And you know what? Let's, you know, just because. Hena. 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 <laughs> Let's make a collar, yo. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this and go over here. Just, you know, tight. Tight collar. YOLO. Oh, see? See, look what I did there. I didn't want to do that. It made two different segments. So I'm gonna go ahead and join them, yo. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna bring this up a little high. I'm gonna bring this up a little high. Bring this up a little closer. And I'm gonna go ahead and do this. And I'm gonna go ahead and round it. And now it looks kind of weird, but that's okay, cause we can fix it. Don't worry about it being perfect. Right now, I'm just trying to teach. Ritana, you are not a good teacher. I understand that. Will you just shut up? Ominous voice from nowhere. So now you got, I got a collar. <laughs> Oh, but the lines! Oh my god, the lines! These, these chalk dials, fancy, and these chalk dials. So I'm gonna go ahead and select this. Gonna make a node right there. Gonna select in between, see if the two nodes are highlighted, and gonna kabam! And then we're gonna do it again. And oh my god, magic! Whoa! Yeah! So, voila, me's got dressing color. 
Now, how do you change the size of the lines, yo? This is where we're going to go back to object and fill in stroke. So, you see that it is selected that your stroke has color. Well, bye bye stroke. Hello stroke. So, over here, you got your hues, you got your saturation, and you got your lightness. Oh, and, um, what does A stand for? I would have put O alpha opacity. See, that's why I would have put O. So, say you want it a little bit transparent, this opacity. So, you want it lighter. That's lightness. Now, we get a lighter, but we want it pink. And saturation. Okay, that's purple. Let's go a bit pink. And, uh, see, lightness. Voila. And then it'll go back to black. Then, you can go to stroke style, and you can make it as fat as you fucking want. See, look, fat line. And you can also, okay, go to, you gotta hold the arrow. Go to dashy dash. Got some longer, uh, I guess that's a longer line. Got some dashes and dots, yo. Got some dots. I haven't really played around with much other than that. More dots. Solid line. Now I'm going to bring this back down to one because I really don't want it thick yet. I do that mainly at the end. That's what she said. Now, for me, since I don't know how to say color this, now watch, 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 watch. Ha! Huh! Oh, God. Let's try this. Ha! Huh! Okay, so it's kind of going over. I guess I could. No, I can't. So that's, <laughs> I don't know how to do that. And that's what I use Photoshop for, yo. But if you have a closed segment, you could totes just fill it. And yo, <laughs> we want it. I said yellow. Yellow. Yeah, that's how you fill that. But I don't want that. So I'm not going to have it. I mainly just, oh, 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 oh. But you can also do like gradients and like that. I don't know what that really does. Yeah, but I don't want that. <laughs> so that's, that's that. And uh, when you use the pencil, it's a cool thing because you can adjust the curve on it. For the line, basically, you know, you're doing stuff. Double click to end the segment. Um, for the line, yes, you can bend it. Bendy, bendy, boo. Bendy, bendy, woo. Uh, don't like it. Now, text is over here, blobbity bleebity blue, penis. <laughs> um, over here, it says, make a square. Cool. Oh, what if I do this? Eh? Eh? Triangle! Woo! Five, what does this do? Now, how do I... Whoa! So that's how you round that. Ah, there we go. There we go. I was having issues with that. So you can make a star, or you can make, I don't know, Yay! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> We're having fun now! <laughs> now, there's a lot of tools that I haven't played around with. You can play around with them. I just, you know, stick to the basics because I can do a lot of different stuff in Photoshop, really. Yeah, so when you don't want things to snap, so like, say I want eyes, okay? I put the eyes and say I want to move them around. Uh, oh no! Oh no! Uh, uh, oh no! <laughs> so. Unpress the snappy snoo, and then you got eyes. All right. I know how to do a couple of things. Willing to learn the rest of the stuff? Probably not. Not yet, at least. Oh! There's swirly swirls. Wait! You made a swirl. How many? How many get it? Whoa! Uzumaki des. Uzumaki. <laughs> you can also say, go to layers, you can change the opacity of said layers, and you can move layers up or down, you know, depends on what flies your zeppelin. With some sh shapes, you can press break apart and they become two different objects. Speaking of objects, say I click this and I click this and we go to object and you're going to go group. Now they are the same thing. Okay. Uh, that's really the basics that I know of, just fucking around with this thing. Um, but since I showed you what I know, you guys are probably more intent on learning the stuff, so you can fuck around with it a little more and know how to, and, and become a pro, yo. The cool thing about it is, is if you go, say, save as, okay, it's gonna save it as an SVG, which is a scalable vector graphic. I'm gonna save it as drawing. Now, when you save it, it's going to come up as an internet thing. You could press open with Inkscape to edit it more, but if you just double-click it, it's going to open up an internet explorer, yo! Say save as, 
If you save it as a bitmap, it's going to have a white background. Save it as a PNG, put it in here, transparent background, then you can, like, do stuff. And, yeah. So, sorry if, uh, I'm a little retarded when it comes to this program, but I do what works, okay? I do what works for moi. Don't fix something that's not broken. <laughs> okay, so make sure to subscribe, spread the word of boss, and become a Raytonite, and I shall see you guys later. Bye! Not stroke it like stroke it, guys, but like, okay, come on. <laughs> Hi, hello, my name is El Dante. You senoritas all want me. Excuse me for my bold vaunting, but I'm pretty damn good in the sack. Olay! <laughs> <laughs> ah. Whoopsies. My bad.